Fashionably late. I thought you weren't gonna show. <laughs> I'm late, and you decide to make the Winter Palace rubble. Eh? Never liked it anyway. Too fancy. So tell me everything that happened while I was away. And after the betrayal, and what I put those men through, my sorries were worth about as much as shit. How many people hit you? I lost count at 12, but I could take a punch. They needed to know that there's a way to come back from anything. And I wanted to help them if I could. I thought going up there on the gallows was difficult. This was worse. A hundred times worse. Anyway, it's nice to be back. Though I'm not sure what to think of this council. No matter what, you know you can always count on my sword arm and my friendship. If that's your sword arm, I think I'm better off without it. Think you can do better. Inquisitor. The Prince of Starkhaven wrote to you again. Well, of course he did. Just put that one in the pile with letters from the Merchants Guild. And the Captain of the City Guard had a very colorful message for me to deliver to you as well. Inquisitor! Andraste's ass, am I ever glad to see you! And the Inquisitor comes to the rescue once again. Is that what you call it? Uh, this is Bran Caven. Until recently he was the Viscount Provisional Viscount of Kirkwall. So why is he here with messages from the Merchant's Guild? I have resumed my post as Seneschal now that Master Tethras has been elected Viscount. You're the Viscount of Kirkwall now? Well, it seems the two of you have a great deal to discuss. Why don't I just leave you to it? So. It turns out, you fund enough reconstruction efforts in a city-state, the nobles give you the worst job they can think of. That's fantastic. You'll make an excellent Viscount. I think the nobility figured, after Dumar and Perrin, what's the worst that could happen if we put the dwarf in charge? They voted me in because I got the harbor and businesses up and running again. They want shit fixed, and I can do that. Anyway, I was hoping I'd catch you before the summit got underway. I got you a sort of present. It's official recognition of your title and holdings in Kirkwall. Congratulations. You're a Compt now. You can't actually do that without... Too late. Already did it. You should stop by Hightown sometime to see your estate. It's pretty nice. For Kirkwall, anyway. Proper disposition of empty estates is supposed to... <clears throat> you were leaving us to talk, remember? <sighs> this is possibly too much, Varric. I don't know what to say. That's nothing. <laughs> Practically nothing. Don't mention it. Oh, that reminds me. It's the key to the city. You can't give that away without approval from the Council and a special ceremony. It... It's just symbolic, anyway. It controls one of the giant chain nets in the harbor. Really? That is so much better than I thought.
This operates those giant chains. Can I try it? No. I don't know how this council thing is going to end for the Inquisition. But whatever gets decided, you've got a place lined up in Kirkwall if you want it. Also, uh, control of the harbor, I guess? Anyway, you should meet with the diplomats. And we'll get in a game of Wicked Grace before I go back, though, right? I wouldn't miss it. Don't bet any public buildings this time. It's been quite a day so far, has it not? I've been speaking with representatives from everywhere. Have they given you trouble? Not at all. It is quite alarming. It means they are all saving themselves up for later. Would you walk with me? I should like to take some air before the Exalted Council becomes inescapable. The palace has been most accommodating. We are, after all, here at their insistence. But the minister may... No. No more talk of the Council. This meeting was to spend time with you in a more relaxed fashion. Is this in your daily notes? Three to four o'clock, idle chat with the Inquisitor. Of course not. <clears throat> not precisely. The truth is, there is a small entertainment happening tonight, to which I may be able to find a pair of invitations. You'd like me to go with you? Very much so. In all the years you worked with Orlais, you had so little time to enjoy its culture. Perhaps you're right. These meetings and talks don't allow for much leisure time. And then back to Skyhold without a moment's pause to take in where we are. With all that's been happening, I promised myself a single evening out. I'd very much like to go with a friend. Thank you for thinking of me. I'd be delighted to attend. Splendid. I will arrange things at once. The past years have been so busy. We have earned at least a few moments of rest. A calm night out sounds... Oh, bravo! Bravo! This was your idea of a restful evening. Oh, wasn't it lovely? It's been so long since I've gone to the opera. But tell me, did you enjoy the performance? That was... one of the greatest things I've ever seen. Truly? That part with the glittery 